Hi guys, it's Isla again. Sorry for the hiatus. I've been working really hard, really, really tired. Um, my headache has been doing weird things. So, anyway, I'm back with, uh, this is the start of all of my February boxes. Uh, so, and I still haven't put up January's yet. I'll probably put those up first, so ignore everything I just said. <laughs> Anyway, this is my Bow Candy subscription for February 2016. Bow Candy is an international candy subscription that is $15 a month for what I have. Uh, you can get a smaller box that has like a few different types I have um, for cheaper prices. Open it up. This is what I got. A lot of candy. Usually they have a card telling you what you have. They stopped doing that and then they did email lists so I print out my email so I could actually go through this. So let's start with the first one. We have oh, a lot. I got one, two, three, four, five. I got five of these small candy bars. Uh, these are Kex from Kex Chocolade from Sweden. Um, and these are this person remind, uh, says that they're kind of like American Kit Kats. So let's see. No, it's just a wafer. I mean, it's just a bar. It smells good. Chocolate, of course. Oh my god, these are so good. <laughs> Looks like that. I don't know if you can see. My lighting is a little off still. It's basically a wafered bar. Many small wafers on top of each other. In between chocolate and then covered in chocolate and this chocolate is really good so I really like this <laughs> next item is Gorlaki sorry if I butcher all these names because this is from Poland Gorlaki Trusko Wakoi, whatever. I'm sorry. It's like a strawberry wafer bar. <laughs> wafer with strawberry filling. Product of Slav Slovakia. Yeah. Why is there a product of Slovakia if it's made in Poland? I mean, isn't Slovakia a neighboring country or something? Okay, I'm trying to open it. Okay, well, looks like this. It's many layers of plain wafer, it looks like. It's covered on the edges by chocolate to seal it together. Interesting. I will say it does smell very strawberry. <laughs> Makes me feel a little bit sad. It has a lot of strawberry flavor, but I wish it had more chocolate flavor. Because <laughs> you really do get the texture of the wafers alone. And the wafer texture is a wafer, and that's why in America we usually don't have wafers alone. It's always covered in chocolate. So, it just is weird. The strawberry is very pronounced, even though it doesn't look like it has a lot, but it does. Um and it's tart strawberry so i'll eat it um 
it's good just wasn't exactly what my taste buds wanted I guess I don't know how to say that uh, next item we have is seven day croissant from Bulgaria with cocoa filling and this thing is still very very soft it feels like I've gotten this last week <laughs> um, the information sheet says that it has a hazelnut flavor, kind of like Nutella. Um, so let's try. No, it's not really croissant shaped. It's more like a bun, but oh well, I don't care. I will say it's very, very soft, buttery feel. Um, surprised how soft it is. Ripping it open. So, croissant with chocolate inside. I think that's more chocolate than nut than Nutella. Oh. No, that was mainly a uh, without the chocolate. Let's try it with the chocolate. Oh my god, we need these here. <laughs> they taste so good. Mmm. <laughs> these are great. Um I just want to know how they get, wait, it says preserved. Yeah, I don't know. Half of it is in English though, so, oh. Yeah, anyway, it is very, very soft, which I'm surprising because I don't know when they actually made this. This is good, really good. <laughs> then we have A handful, well, kind of bigger than a handful, um, of these pokey, pokeos, whatever, toffee kubanka, which this is also from Poland, um, and they're basically made, um, they're influenced by Cuban confectionery culture, but they're Polish. try one so okay it's wrapped in this and then it's wrapped again oh looks like this They taste good, but I don't think I'd call them toffee. It tastes almost like a, a, a different version of caramel. Same consistency of, as a caramel. So, that's weird. Um, I, I like them. Just wasn't really a, what really was I was expecting, because I don't really like toffee, because it's usually hard. This one was really good. Then we got a lot of different flavors of um, these are fruit drops that are piccolo fruit drops also from Poland um, and I had different flavors I have green apple I have lemon I have orange and I have raspberry they have, they have pictures on them I'm going to choose the orange. They're very, very small. Oh, damn. That is small. So, that's small. I 
don't smell anything. They do have a very strong fruit flavor. That's good. I'm happy with all the candy I got. I'll eat it all. Yay! <laughs> um, they did say that it was supposed to also come with chorus whistle candy from Japan, but I didn't get it in this one. And even though it, they do say that your box may be different because they only print this out for all different berries. But I have, the, I have the normal box, the big box. So I should have gotten it, I guess, but I didn't. So, oh well. So overall, I like this because you get to try diff different foods, different sweets uh, from all over the world. Um, they tend to do a lot from Japan and a lot from like Poland. But it's all good. <laughs> so anyway thank you for watching bye